Since the beginning of time, the first impression in any scenario will always be one that sticks with you. You can't change it or delete it. What's done is done. In the world of combat sports though, the entrance to battle for fighters is where you have to prepare your mind, body and soul for war and accept the reality of the unknown. Very few humans are able to tolerate this type of pressure. And for us fans watching comfortably from the outside, this is a moment that will always get our blood pumping. This is what makes the sport of MMA so addicting. Welcome to the fighting business. Let's revisit some of the most iconic walkouts in UFC history. Number one, Darren Till at Fight Night Liverpool. Darren Till back in 2018 was on a roll and the hype around his name was growing exponentially. I believe him, there hasn't been a single guy in the UFC with one fight that's got as much hype as that guy. You know, one fight fights Cowboys, smashing his yeah. head. He's well, always then. been special. He's one of these kids, like when I seen him growing up, he's one of these kids that just come and he's special. And I mean, the city's behind him, everyone. He was and still is a very likable and unique character. People are often easily attached to his personality and he always makes for a great show. At UFC Fight Night Liverpool, Darren was making the walk for the first time in front of his hometown of Liverpool and he paid tribute with the song Sweet Caroline. The crowd erupted and sang along with Darren making this walk one of the most iconic in UFC history. What a moment for the 25-year-old Scouser paying tribute with the song to Liverpool Number two, Nate Diaz at UFC 263. In occasions like this one, certain fighters making the walk is more iconic than the walk in itself. Nate Diaz has become a global superstar in the past few years, and coming back after almost two years away from the sport, the fans were missing him. Dude, man, yeah. you know, and watching him come back after three years out of the game yeah. and beat Pettis like that. I shot him a message, I was like, bro, you're a bad man. <laughs> he walked out paying tribute to the great late DMX who had passed away earlier in April, making this walk even more iconic to witness. Number three, Israel Adesanya at UFC 243. I mean, I gotta tell you, Adesanya kicks some ass in record time. When it comes down to an entrance, the originality is always something that will captivate our attention. And in the case of Israel Adesanya at UFC 243, his walkout was a performance in itself. Adesanya came out dancing to a choreography with dance partners and made the entrance so much more legendary. Walking out cool and collected in front of a crowd in Melbourne rooting against him. This walk will always be forever amazing to watch. Number 4. Conor McGregor at UFC 189. A Conor McGregor event. A Conor McGregor fight week. A Conor McGregor entrance. There is absolutely nothing more iconic. Honor, take a look around you. You got a lot of champions, a lot of grizzled vets. Who do you think would give you the hardest fight out of anybody on stage? Right here. Right here. The hardest hitting 145 pound. The real hardest hitting 145 are right here. They're not, who the fuck is that guy? No, damn well who I am. Who the fuck is that? Having the privilege as fans to witness a legend at work, not only as a promoter, not only as a fighter, but as a complete creator of what the fight game is today. Conor McGregor, win or lose, will always be the most popular figure in the world of combat sports. I run New York City! I'm a fucking pimp! Rocking Gucci Mick! And without me, this whole fucking shit sink! At UFC 189, the whole package was on full display as Conor was at his peak in his success. Had confidence boosting out of his ears. Thousands of Irish fans cheering, the famous Sinead O'Connor singing in attendance, the now very recognized song Foggy Doo, and an end bins like never seen before. The fighting face of a nation. I'm back through 
the glen I rode again And my heart with grief was sore For I parted then with valiant men Whom I never shall see That was some moment I looked down and Sinead is surrounded by lights and smoke And she just points at me and Sinead is an absolute legend, an Irish hero, a passionate, powerful, strong woman, and her voice sends chills through my spine. Number 5. Brian Ortega at UFC 266. Brian Ortega and Alexander Volkanovsky at UFC 266 probably gave us one of the best fights of the year so far. This, take, take a close look. Cause I know you're all watching. You know who you are, I know you're watching. Take a look. It was a classic and Brian Ortega led the dance with this absolutely unique walkout. Coming out to the Purge theme with trainers and teammates walking alongside with LED masks on. This was a truly unique walkout and gave an amazing intro to what is considered now as one of the greatest fights of the year. Number 6, John Jones at UFC 197. John Jones has had a very bumpy road to fame and success, and there is no one else to blame but himself. You mentioned John Jones, obviously he's in the news right now, uh, unfortunately again for not fighting but for other things. To this day we hear about problems and situations where he gets himself involved, and it's very sad to see such a supreme talent getting caught up with so many demons. But at UFC 197, after getting involved in multiple disturbing situations and getting his belt stripped, John Jones was returning to the Octagon after a 16 month suspension. His entrance was nothing short of iconic. Let the rain wash away, all the pain of yesterday. I know my kingdom awaits, and they've forgiven my mistakes. Tell the world I'm coming home. Coming out to the popular song I'm Coming Home by Diddy. There could not have been a better song to come out to, and the fans in attendance in Las Vegas that night showed their admiration for one of the greatest of all time, making his return to the Octagon. The youngest champion in UFC history, 15 and 1, inside the Octagon, returning for the... With all of that being said, I hope fighters remain original and find unique ways to make their way into the Octagon. It's always a special moment for all of us watching. If you think I missed iconic walkouts, let me know down below. I hope to have you back for all future videos. Peace out.